Hello dear children, good day to all of you. I hope you all are doing good and welcome to the Siro Malabar Catechism classes. I know you all are happy and excited right as we are going to start with our today's class. Lesson number 11. Let us grow in love. Before we start children, let us all stand up, join our hands and say a prayer. Bless us, Lord, as we begin our class today. Fill us with your love, joy and happiness. Bless us, Lord. Amen. Do you remember, children, what we learned in the previous class? Do you remember? Come on, think. Yes, we learnt about saints. Who are saints? Saints are people who follow Jesus, who love Jesus and live the way Jesus wanted them to live. They always did good to others, right? Yes, so we learnt that we should also become like saints. We should live our lives like saints, just like how Jesus wanted us to do. Okay? So in today's class, we will learn how we can grow in the love of Jesus. How we can live our lives just like the way saints did, the way Jesus wanted us to do. Okay, children? Yes, we will learn how we can grow in the love of Jesus. I know children, you all must be wondering, how can I become like Jesus? What should I do to be the child of Jesus, right? You must be thinking, should I look like Jesus? Should I walk like Jesus? Should I wear clothes like Jesus? Should I eat like Jesus? You must be wondering about all this, right? Yes. So my dear little children, Jesus asks you to love the way he did. Love everyone. Just like how Jesus did. That is what he wants you to do today. Okay? Love everyone just like how Jesus did. Selflessly. Imagine you've got a big treasure box. A treasure box that is filled with treasures. And what is this treasure? Can any guesses? This treasure is the love of Jesus. Imagine a treasure box filled with the love of Jesus. Are you all happy? Yeah, I can see you all smiling. Yes, so once you open the treasure box, the love of Jesus is pouring upon you. Yes, so what Jesus wants you to do today is share this treasure with others. Share the love of Jesus with everyone. Yes, children, Jesus wants you to share his love with everyone. Share his love with your parents at home, your brothers, your sisters, your grandparents, your friends at school, at play, everywhere. Share the love of Jesus. Nobody in this world can take away from you the love of Jesus. It is yours and it will always be yours. Okay? Nobody can take away from you the love of Jesus, the gift Jesus has given you, the treasure of his love. Okay, children? But if you want to start loving the way Jesus did, you should start by loving yourself. Start by loving yourself. 
Only if you love yourself can you love others. The way you love yourself is the only way you can love others. If you do not love yourself, it becomes very difficult. Okay, children? So if you want to love everyone just the way like how Jesus did, you should start by loving yourself. Jesus also performed miracles and helped everyone. Yes, children, what you can do is with your talents and gifts that Jesus has given you, you can help others in maybe even the smallest way that you can. Be kind to everybody with a big smile on your face. Okay? Always help others with a smiling face. Be happy to help. Okay? Yes, very good. You know, along with loving everybody and helping everybody, Jesus was a very obedient child. What do I mean by obedient? By obedient, I mean that Jesus would always listen to everybody without back answering. Okay, Jesus would always obey his parents, elders, Respect everybody. Yes, children, respecting your elders, respecting your parents and everybody is very important. So Jesus wants you to be a very obedient child, listening to your parents, your elders and respecting them. Listening to your teachers too. Okay? Jesus understands you, children. I know sometimes it must be difficult for you to obey your parents, right? When they tell you not to do something that you like to. That may sometimes sound fun. Or they may tell you to do so and so that you do not want to do. So it sometimes seems difficult for you. But in such times, you should pray to Jesus. Ask Jesus to give you the strength the wisdom to obey your parents. Ask Jesus to help you be a good child and obey your parents. Okay? Your parents will only tell you the things that are good for you. Because they love you, right? Your parents love you. So they will only tell you what is good for you. To make you a good child. A loving child of Jesus. Okay, children? So always obey and respect your parents and elders. Whatever they tell you is for your good, to make you a good child. Children, now let us make a decision today. Okay? So your decision is, like Jesus, I will also obey my parents and help them too. What is your decision? Let's repeat. Like Jesus, I will also obey my parents and help them too. Okay? So your decision should be followed. Okay, children? So now, let us sing an action song. Are you all excited? So let us sing an action song, okay? Jesus loves me, this I know For the Bible tells me so Little ones to Him belong They are weak but he is strong Yes, Jesus loves me Yes, Jesus loves me Yes, Jesus loves me The Bible tells me so Jesus loves me, he who died Heaven's gate to open he will wash away my sin Let his little child come in Yes, Jesus loves me Yes, Jesus loves me Yes, Jesus loves me The Bible 
world tells me so. Yes, Jesus loves me. Yes, Jesus loves me. Yes, Jesus loves me. The Bible tells me so. Children, now let us learn a Bible verse taken from Matthew chapter 28 verse 20. The Bible verse, Jesus says, I am with you always, even till the end of this world. Let's repeat. Repeat after me. I am with you always, even till the end of this world. So what does Jesus say? Jesus says that he is always with you. Jesus always loves you. Okay? And nobody in this world can take away from you the love of Jesus. By this children, we come to an end of our class today where we learned how we can grow in the love of Jesus. How we can grow in the love of Jesus and follow Jesus. How we should love everybody just the way like how Jesus did. Okay? So to love everybody, you should start by loving yourself. Okay? So we learned that you should always love everybody, respect your elders and your parents, always obey them, never ever back answer and be good children. You should also help everybody with a big smile on your face. Okay? So when you start to live the way like how Jesus wants you to do, your heart will be filled with happiness and joy with the love of Jesus. Okay, children? Yes. So let us all grow in the love of Jesus. So see you in the next class. Until then, bye-bye. Thank you and God bless you.